130 school threat arrest. A 16-year-old charged with threatening a school in Miramar appears in court. That threat appeared on social media, and the teen was taken into custody last night. Police say he threatened to shoot up Everglades High School. CBS 4's Peter Dench was in court for that teenager's hearing. This 16-year-old student appeared before a judge accused of threatening to bring a gun to Everglades High School and shoot it up. This happened after he reportedly said he was bullied in class and called retarded and stupid. It's scary. The allegations alarm parents like Marie Titus. Even this morning, you know, I'm not very happy to take my son to school. But I'm praying that nothing happened to him. Police say when the student made the threat in class, another student heard it and they took to social media. It was going around all, everywhere. A student sent CBS4 one of the Instagram messages from Wednesday, which read, Tomorrow X threatened to shoot up the school on God Stay Woke or Do Not Show Up. This was the fourth incident recently in which students opposed a threat to schools. On Tuesday, police say a nine-year-old brought a loaded gun into Paul Turner Elementary School in Lauder Hill and threatened three students who bullied him. At Southwest Senior High School in Miami-Dade, Police arrested a student for having an unloaded weapon in his backpack. Threats of violence to school are considered a crime. It's a second degree felony. Broward School Superintendent Robert Runcy is alarmed. And we're encouraging our parents uh, and guardians to speak uh, with their children about the serious nature of these actions. A judge ordered that the 16-year-old student be held for 21 days in secure detention while wearing an electronic monitor, and he will not be able to return to Everglades High School. The chief assistant public defender says he was bullied far too much. But the school system needs to look at uh, the pervasiveness and the ongoing bullying that's occurring uh, that's causing children to feel helpless um, and take things into their own hands.